Okay. My name is Tom Dietz. I used to be the director of the African Study Center between 2010 and 2017. And as a director of a center like this, you're also very much responsible for the library. And I always had a lot of pride in uh, being responsible for that library because I think it's one of the pearls in the crown of this center and now of Leiden University. Um, the library um, was set up almost immediately or immediately after the start of the center in 1947 and it collected uh, so many things that now from the whole world people are coming to this library to find things they can never find anywhere else. Um, recently, the last 10 years, the library has tried to really develop online uh, presentation and online visibility. And for instance, the country portal that the library co-developed and also many of the services like the web dossiers uh, are, are treasures. They are really, really useful for many users. And those users don't have to come to the library physically, but they can uh, really use the the, uh, the computer to find out what's there. Um, recently the Library of the African Study Center has become part of the uh, setup of Leiden University as a whole and our dream is to have a full-fledged Africa library in 2022 where this library would be the core but also other library and other library treasures would be integrated in that library. In fact connecting all the knowledge that is there in Leiden uh, on Africa with the knowledge that we have at the African Studies Center here in, in Leiden. Um, the interesting point about this library is that people who come here expecting to find a lot of things very often go away with the idea they have found everything and much more than they expected. And I, as an anecdote, it's very interesting to tell you that we had a visitor from the Democratic Republic of Congo he used to be um, the uh, rector uh, of the chancellor of that university. And he was here on a visit, to uh, just a formal visit. And we, we brought him to the library. And of course, he wanted to find out what is there on Congo. And then he was amazed to find his master's thesis as a student in Congo uh, in this library. And then he said, this is impossible. This is nowhere to be found. I don't even have one myself anymore. So it was, it was really nice to find out. So I think this library uh, should be cherished. Uh, we, uh, and we not only the scholars in Leiden and the students in Leiden, but in fact the whole community uh, of Africanists in the world should be proud of this library and should really try to, to make it even better. Thank you.